A very crucial part of off-roading is having the right communication and recovery tools while you're on the trail for safety and to keep the fun going. A very popular and necessary tool to stay in touch with your friends on the trail is a CB radio. The standard 40 channel CB radio needs multiple components to get hooked up and ready to go and that's where the antenna mount adapter and coax cable come in handy. The included adapter means that you can work this with your current CB radio and we also sell every part you need if you're just getting into the radio game. This rear mounted antenna is very popular because it's out of the way of debris and trees and the metal on the tire mount makes a great antenna ground for clear long communication. The install on this guys is a one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter and I'll touch on that in just a moment. This is just a piece of the puzzle to get a CB setup ready to go and you'll still need the antenna and the radio itself to have a complete package. The included mount is made of a high strength aluminum that will insulate and resist corrosion so it can hold up to the elements. It also includes all of the hardware needed to secure it to the spare tire mount. Some Jeep owners, including myself, like to run the Jeep without a spare tire on the back. And the thing that I like about this is that you don't necessarily need the actual spare tire mount to attach it because the mount is designed to work with the holes that are placed there from the factory. There are other options out there for the antenna to be mounted, but in my personal experience, this mount's placement is the cleanest and most practical option. The mount is also designed to be positioned right next to the grommet in the tailgate to feed the wire through. Speaking of the wire, the coax cable here is 18 feet, and it's the perfect length to reach from the tailgate to the front of the Jeep while being comfortably tucked into the interior trim while keeping your wiring hidden and clean. The cable has a PL259 adapter that's 3 8 inch by 24, which broken down means that it's a universal fit for any mounted CB. It also will fit with any standard CB radio antenna that you would like to use, including the very popular four foot fire stick antenna that we sell on our site. Mopar is the Jeep's manufacturing company, so you can expect OEM quality out of this mount. This package is gonna run you right around the $50 mark and is pretty affordable for two major CB components that you need in the whole bundle. Now there are not many options to compare this to on the site at this moment because this is the only kit that comes with the mount and the coax cable. There are other options for just the mount and they're gonna be a little under half the price for the cable and the mount that you see here, but they're not gonna be an OEM fit or quality and they might not mount in the same place either. There's also an option that includes the cable, the mount, and the antenna, but this option here will give you a choice of which antenna you would like to pair with your CB radio. Considering there are really no other choices that include the coax cable, this is gonna be the best option overall if the cable and the mount is what you're looking for. Like I said earlier, if you were just getting into the CB game, check out the Fire Stick antenna and the United CB radio and mount available on our page. They run you about $99 for the rest of the whole package, and this will give you a turnkey kit that's been very popular in the Jeep community for years. This install is gonna be very straightforward, and I'm gonna give it a one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter, because really all it is is a couple of bolts and some wire tucking. I would say this should only take you about 30 minutes and a couple of hand tools to get everything all hooked up and installed. First things first, you're gonna free up some room by removing your spare tire. And then you're going to locate the two upper right bolts and remove them and sandwich the mount in between the new hardware and the tire carrier. If you have an antenna at this time, you can connect the coax cable to the antenna and feed the cord through the grommet in the tailgate. You're gonna need to remove the plastic piece in the inside of the tailgate to expose the wires so you can reach the cable and run it through. Then you can start tucking the cable into the back trim and down along the edge all the way to the front. Now when you reach the front, where the end of the cable is gonna go is gonna depend on where you are mounting your CB radio. Once your CB radio is mounted in the spot that you want it to, you can attach the cable to the back of the CB radio and you're all set up and ready to go. All these instructions with pictures will be included in the box as well for reference. So if you're looking to stay connected to your buddies on the trails, but need those few extra components to get you there, this Mopar mount and coax cable package is going to do the job. 
I'm Meredith with XT, and for this and everything else Wrangler, keep it right here at ExtremeTerrain.com.